Whoa, 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 stop the music, stop the music, stop the music, please stop, please stop. What, what, what? Sneaker shopping, sing one alpha, take one. What, what are we face rugging? I don't want this to be a regular intro. I want to show up like a boss. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Actually, on second thought, got my hairline back. Let's tone it down a little bit. No, no, no. For my episode, I want to go all out. I want flames right here. I want a dragon over there. Uh, let's get that going, okay? Got it, Evan? Joe flew all the way from New York to Houston? This hairline's pressure right now. We gotta make this a banger. What's up, everybody? It's Joe from Complex. We're in Houston now, Premium Goods, with legendary content creator, Gideon. What's good, Joe? How you doing? I'm doing great, man. I'm doing great. Gonna do some sneaker shopping today. Gonna see what he's feeling, what he's not, and then hopefully he's gonna buy some sneakers. Definitely. Let's go. Gideon, we'll get to my questions a little later, but we gotta talk, you pulled up big red boots. Talk about like what you're wearing right now. No, I got 50 on my wrist. Okay. 100K on my feet, 200 on my neck, but you know the craziest thing about the most expensive thing on me right now? That the is. new hairline. New hairline. How does it feel? New person, new hairline? <gasps> new hairline, new me, man. You know, I can see the horizon finally and I have to have the kicks to match, bro. So here we are. Getting me right. Here we are. What was the process like? I'm not gonna lie, you know, it was a 69% chance that I could die in the procedure. And, you know, I was I was willing to make that sacrifice. Look, looking good. Came correct for the new episode. I wanna talk about like you growing up. What like in Clear Lake were you wearing? What, what? Oh, no. you moving federal now. No, no, federal. no, no. Oh, what oh, were oh. we wearing? Doxing we... me online is crazy. <laughs> what were we wearing back then? Like what was like the shoes back then? You see, back then, like, you know, I really wasn't too much in the sneakers, you know? I was just wearing some light shit, like, you know, Armani during the week. Okay. Kind of like if I was feeling, like, bored or didn't feel like getting dressed up, you know, I might throw on some off-whites or something like that. Really? Back then? Yeah, back then. Yeah. Oh, wow. But so, now we up the levels. Okay. And, you know, classic, like, Air Force Ones, we see the store premium goods. What about the selection? What do you like here? Oh, man, I mean, I'm like a lot. A lot of these are looking nice, but uh, me personally, I'm more of a Adidas guy. Okay. When I seen that new Ninja collab that they came out with, I almost shed a tear. It was amazing. Actually, do you guys have any Ninja collabs here? I don't think so. So you've been searching for those for years, though. I saw like you were asking for the, for the Tylers. I was asking for the Tyler, the Tyler 11s. And still haven't got them. Still haven't gotten them. And like, you know, we see the Essential Sphere of God, the big red boots. What made you wear those today? You know, man, this is just something light. You feel me? Like, this is what I roll out the bed in. Roll out the bed. And is it tough to get on or what? We see the videos online of like those getting, you know, really hard to put on. But was it easy? It's like Thor, you know? If you're not worthy to pick it up, it's going to be hard. Okay. But I'm worthy, so shit's easy. And then like, how's like the athletic ability in those? Like, exactly. <laughs> So you move quick. That's that defensive end coming back out, right? J.J. Watt. Or Aaron Donald, I heard. I like J.J. Watt more. Okay. But in high school, who were you like compared to? What is it, J.J. Watt? Man, you're going back, bro. You see, I could have went D1. You know, Nick Saban, he came by the crib. He was trying to recruit. But uh, I just looked at the landscape of YouTube, and I was like, damn, shit's dry. Everybody out here phase rugging it. So I had to turn on the cam, and seven million subs later, here we Look are. Look at it. And a new hairline. And a new hairline. You know, it's a lot of success comes like the pitfalls. Through the years, sneaker shopping, you've had some luck and like some bad luck. We got to talk about the shoe palace. Are we, you know, it seems like years ago, have we put that behind us? What's the status of that beef right now? You seem like you're in a different space. You see, I am, but okay. the trauma's still there. For those that don't know, um, I have a ongoing beef with the shoe palace manager named Tyrone. He wouldn't give me my size 13. And I'm not gonna lie, I haven't stepped foot in a shoe store since. So this is like your first time? This is my first time. How's it, how does it feel? I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm kind of jittery, you know. I don't got my own fire, so I have to bring security in the club, so that's why I have my security guards here right now. Okay. But you're making me comfortable, Joe. Just as long as you give me my size 13s, like... We got a whole, they got a whole bunch. Okay, 
Thank you. You talked about like your, you know, the high school where you would pull up in like a lot of high fashion shoes, but when you would wear like the suits though, what were you wearing? You wearing Tom Ford suits, a clear light? Oh man, you know, I had to like pop out, you feel me? Like, I felt like everybody kind of wore the same thing and stuff like that. And I was just like, you know what? What if I just pop out to school in a suit? So I would do that. And I feel like that's the same thing with YouTube, you know? It's like, you know, what if I just go sit courtside at an NBA game and go get a haircut, you feel me? Like, yeah. that's just my personality. I want to do things differently. If all the other content creators are going right, I'm gonna go sideways. Okay, okay. And like, what were the sneakers you were pairing with suits, though? Mmm, sneakers I was pairing with suits. You see, I'm not gonna lie, that's low-key like a forbidden, but uh, if I were, I would have to get the white mochas all day. These okay. are one of my personal favorites. Okay. <laughs> The Kim Possibles. Okay. These are classics. Like, uh, I remember actually standing in line to get these. I stood in line for 72 hours. It was crazy. Air Max 95. You call them? The, they're the called the Kim Possibles. Okay. Like in my hood, we call them the Kim Possibles. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Another thing, you know, when you wanted to like channel some energy, you went to the sneaker store, you got Black Air Force Ones. Mm. What was it like to get those? And you know, they became a meme, but like you felt different in those. Oh no, yeah, definitely. You know, I felt like Gucci Man in 2006 when I put those on. But the thing about it though, is I feel like it came with a cost because after I put those on and I did that devastating diss track on Tyrone, I woke up the next morning without my hairline. So I went three long years without a hairline, but. You know what they call that? What? Karma. Mm. But we're back. We back. Okay. Better we're than back. ever. <laughs> we're back. Hey, price went up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Complex. Exactly. Price went up. <laughs> <laughs> Another thing we got to talk about a special package that you got in the mail. Demarcus Cousins mm. sent you his Pumas. Signed. Signed. And you thought they were in your, your size. They were his size. What was it like getting that? Bro, I'm not going to lie. That was, it was crazy, bro. You know, just for my grandpa to show me love like that, send me his kicks. But you know, I lost them actually because I got evicted out of my old crib, so. Cause I thought you were gonna put them like behind a glass case. You even said that. I liked you did the unboxing, you were eating something, you're like, I can't have mm -hmm. messed up fingers on They were gonna be a family heirloom, you know? Like, you know, DeMarcus Cousins the first had it, you know, my father had it, now DeMarcus Cousins the third had it, but you know, I screwed up. So if you have my kicks, I'm not gonna lie, please give them back, like, please. Like, no, no joke stuff, please. I thought they were somewhere like, yeah, protected in a glass case, no. Hit a lick on me. All right, we have one more section. We got to talk some of your favorite footwear. Let's get it. Let's go. Oh, wait. <laughs> Pulled up in the big red boots, but a lot of like content creators, they like sandals, they like Crocs, they like the Yeezy foam runners. What do you think it's about that footwear that they gravitate to. You see, the old Gideon, that's all I would wear is Crocs and everything. Crocs, I'm still waiting for my brand deal. You know, I can rejuvenate your company. Yeah, man, I think it was just something about humbleness, you know? It just like kind of keeps us down to earth and stuff. But uh, ever since I got this hairline, you know, the price went up, so. Different. Different. You're like the Crocs aficionado, but Yo. are they getting, what do you, are they getting, are they getting, <laughs> what, do you, what do you think about these? Bro. With the lights. The floodlights. Some people seem like they're split on it. That's crazy. And they're your size. Now when I'm running in sports mode, I can see where I'm going. It's, so sport mode is something I just learned about. What you put? You just flip it. Oh right? yeah, you just flip it back. What do you think about like the types of charms that they're doing? How, do you have the lights? I know that you have an extensive crop. I collection. do not have the lights. I actually have my bigger than black and white ones, but these, bro. Thank you. Yeah, I got you. That's crazy. If only they weren't. I'm not gonna lie. Fuzzy is crazy. The furry. So that's the thing. We're in Houston. I thought, like, I know it's hot here, but I'm from New York, so the winterized ones. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. My my feet would be smelling like Badusi if I wore these. Okay. But you know what? It's a gift from you, so I'm gonna wear them. Man. Appreciate so it. Appreciate it. I'm gonna stink up the room. Okay, we actually have another gift. Bro. Chill, yeah, we chill. have. A, so these are actually. Do Whoa, you know what these are? I don't. These are the Salehi Bembury Crocs. These are like the hottest Crocs. What's he's a fuck? he's a fashion designer. He's worked with like. New Balance, Montclair, but these are super. So All right, oh, we appreciate you, yeah, man. These are Thank super you. sought after. You could pull up to like the the Met Gala in those Fashion Week. You and know what's your crazy? Size. I actually want to do a prank at the Met Gala. I probably shouldn't be saying that, but like one day Met Gala, I'm gonna be walking down the wrong way. Yeah, so these are your size. They sell out like everywhere. Really? And he's had a great collaboration with Crocs. But yeah, we weren't sure if you got those, so I, we made sure to-, to Definitely listen. didn't have these. Bro, you're gonna see me rocking these in my videos. I'm probably gonna okay. get arrested in these. Oh, well, okay. We're gonna put those aside. Thank you, mentioned, you, thank you. Yeah, really appreciate yeah, that. The, the, listen, the light ones, you know, you have fun with, but the Salehi ones, fire.
You just talked about the Crocs collab. Is it closer to happening or, or what? You see, I feel like I gotta get my motion up, you know what I mean? Okay. Like, you know, Bella Porch, she's the most talented person on earth, so I understand why she got hers. But, you know, once I get my motion in motion, we can see what happens. Okay, and do you have design? What's the design in your head? Do you have the design already or something like? But I'm not gonna lie, the thing I want for mine is I want it to be like a shoe. Because okay. me personally, like, I always wear Crocs, but I want it to be something where it's like, you don't have to even wear a shoe ever again. It's like, these can be your things. Cause like, I like just popping out in the same thing every day. Like I just, all I do is wear my merch. Speaking about my merch, they wouldn't let me wear my merch. Sorry about that, <laughs> sorry about that, sorry about that. But you, the merch is available. At shopjadion.com. Go get that. They didn't want me to raw dog it. They wanted me to wrap up. It's crazy chat. <laughs> all right, listen, we talked about everything. Now's the easy part, browser Wait, wait, show. wait, hold up. Before we continue, I wanna talk about these real quick. Okay. You see, if homeboy got these on, you know, it's quiet. This has happened to me before. But if homeboy has these on, he can like get it. I, I heard that before. You heard that before? Yeah. Who said that? There was an episode where that happened. Oh shit, it's crazy. Very aware. Well, we talked about everything. Now's the easy part. Browse the shelf, see what you're gonna take home. Let's do it. Let's go. Uh... So this is my whole crew. I want to make sure that they get right as well. Sorry. Yo, it's good. Thank you. Sir, what y'all looking at? Uh, I'm not gonna lie. You used to like very opium, so I think I'm gonna go with Terry. Yeah, right come on, here. you gotta shine. Try, I can't be a bling bling shine shine. Hey, who's next? Who's what you got? Um, you know, I like some calm, some like this, soft colors. You know, I like ducks. For sure. I got you. All right. I want to switch it up. I got too many white shoes in my catalog. Oh, so. this one's off the budget. Hey, whoa, 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 let's, whoa, let's go to the kids. That's right there. <laughs> That's me. You're good on that. I got you. Now it's time for that to the shop. Hold <laughs> up, hold up, hold up. Big ball. Okay. <laughs> well, get the fuck out the front. Oh, are we done? <laughs> <laughs> so I had asked Joe off camera what was like the most anyone ever spent, and he said that Juice World did. So first thing first, RIP Juice World. And I don't want to disrespect him and go over it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go right under it and we're going to be spending, what, like 41,000, right? Yep, yes sir. We're going to spend 41,000 and not only that, all the shoes, we're going to give it to a local charity out here in Houston and uh, yeah. Let's go, let's get it. So what do you want to get picked out? I want to get pretty much every single white Air Force that you for have. Sure. Got gotcha. you. Get that for Men's, them. kids. Men's, kids, women. Let's pretty much get everyone of this size and every uh, gender and for the kids, and then let's do this one as well. Sophia and, and Bella, got you. Yeah, let's go. Awesome. Did you get everything you needed today? Got everything I needed. Got the shoes for my boys. Got the shoes for charity. Um, what's what's all these? Are these theirs? So nah, we brought these out for you. These are from the vault. Oh, we heard you were coming through, so we had to take care of you. Got some old heat. 2004, got some Travis Scott's, Pat and Bread's. Had to take care of you. Damn. You know what? I'm kind of tired of just wearing Fox every day, so I'll get these two. Got the splurge, got a ball out. Got a ball out. New hairline, new shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Ready for your total? Ready. Let me hear it. All right. Your total is going to be $41,562.60. And Juice World is $42,000, so we're right under him. Hey, everybody in the comments section, 999. I think I'm like the first ever person on here to like pay with a check. Oh, wow. I haven't seen one of these in years. <laughs> See, the way my bank account works is like, oh, okay. <laughs> gotta use paper. All right, I'm gonna bag these up for you. When are you gonna pick up the rest? Um, I'll pick up the rest next week. All we'll right, sounds good. We'll be here next week ready for you.
So Gideon came through, told some great stories, donated a bunch of pairs to charity. Thanks so much for taking the time. Bro, man, I appreciate you, man. I've been watching this since I was in middle school. So wow, man, thank fun. you. Got some heat for himself and his crew too. Thanks again. Appreciate you. Where can we see the uh, charity? If you guys want to see us giving away the charity, uh, just subscribe to my channel, Jadeon. And yeah, we'll be giving them away soon once I get back in town to pick them all up. And oh, also subscribe to my OnlyFans. Oh. Need, that, need to make that money back, you feel me? All right, I got you.